Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to Hey Pikmin here on the Game Wings Let's Plays channel, and it's Yay! time for Spring Petal Cave. Is that Spring is Petal Cave? Spring Petal Cave. All right, there it is, Sector Three, Area C. I have a cat on my lap, so make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for Shadow for the, the Cat. For Shadow, yeah, Shadow. And for the peach stylus that you keep petting, Shadow. Stop, stop. It's a manly. Salmon. Uh, Lucas Luke is, has a peach stylus in his hand. It Hate has, you. It's Princess Peach. It's oh, pink. Thanks. Thanks for that, really. And <laughs> he's having little Peach give Shadow a massage on her head. <laughs> I don't know how she feels about that. Okay, this is an interesting mechanic. All right, so he's like, I need flower. to jump on this flower in order to get those seeds. Yeah, I don't think that's working out very oh, well for you. Oh, lead Pikmin is really heavy for how tiny he is. Okay, like so let's show you guys more of the screen. There you Whee! go. And come on down here with that stuff, guys. Come on. We want it all for ourselves. Well, too bad. Bring it Bring it to Papa. Papa wants. Thanks very much. Wow. Olimar has those Pikmin whipped. So, um, <laughs> I was actually doing a little bit of reading ahead, uh, according to my press release for this game, and it turns out there are six sectors in total Ooh. so my original analysis that this game would be about mm, 12 or 13 episodes was incorrect this is going to be almost a two-week series um and uh i'm gonna do our best to, to get as much done tonight because there's uh, some like uh injustice stuff coming out starfire's coming out and sonic mania that release date is getting closer and closer so pikmin's got to be done this week it's got to be finished you know, because I mean, we're the K Wings, and we look at so many games, and uh, <laughs> yep, we we're we gotta K move on. Wings, and we look at games. I don't know, that just came out. It, you know what? You can delete that part. <laughs> Plus, every day that I wake up, I don't know if you feel this way, but I get so excited to look at Metopia. Oh my gosh! Yeah, it's like I have something. It's like when that feeling you got as a little kid coming home. And watching Batman the Animated Series right after school at 4 o'clock. Kind of. I mean, I'm very excited about looking at Metopia, but on the other hand, um, my character right now is, in, like, captured, and I'm not very happy about that, so. Oh, you have two cats on your lap now. Yeah, I know. They're kind of distracting me. Stay put there, little kitten. <laughs> hey! Don't attack the other kitty. Don't attack the elder cat. Be kind, Zelda. She was trying to drink my V8 juice, too. <laughs> there you go. Oh, what are the rock Pikmin up to? Oh, those guys. Ooh. They rock. No, they look pretty sad, actually. They just broke something. What did you guys do? I don't even understand it. Hmm. Well, okay, there was nothing really important here other than that heart piece for me, but I don't really need it from what I can see, so... Yeah. I really like the aesthetics of this level. I, I just, it's so awesome. It's pretty. You know, with the different diamonds reflecting and the rocks and stuff like that. I like the purple rock. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, I mean, like, I'm I'm really happy with Metopia. I mean, other people seem to really enjoy it, too. So, you know, it's been a while that, uh, you know, we had a series that people really enjoyed that much. So I, I like it. What are you doing, Zelda? Oh, she wants to get off. Okay, as long as she doesn't walk I, all I my like legs I like when we again. have a fun cutesy game. We got two going on right now. We got Pikmin and Metopia. So. How much was left of that one game, Fantasy Life, was really big, wasn't it? Oh my gosh. Because we never streamed Fantasy Life. We did it as a Let's Play. Yeah, we did. I think that would do better. I mean, I think immediately after that, I could get right in from Metopia and finish as a live stream series, like we did with Metopia. Finish, um... Yokai Watch, because there's only two hours left of the game according yeah, to Abdallah. Yeah, I mean, you could do you could do it at four every day mm -hmm. and finish it off like that. Yeah, definitely. Or you could always do some like retro games or something. I have to test that equipment we got for the retro stuff because I'm not, I haven't had a chance to do it yet. Because, I mean, you know, we have that Spider-Man 64 thing I want to do. You want to play Banjo-Kazooie. Which I yeah, would, you I know. do, but I actually have never played it. I'll be honest. I, I've never played it either. I've seen so. people in my family play it and have fun, but like I said, I didn't really 
own any Nintendo game systems. I didn't really play any systems I didn't own. You were a Sega, Sega girl. So... Yeah, so I, my family got me a Sega from, like, I think it was a garage sale or something, so I Lucky. had... Lucky! Mm, I guess. I mean, I like... What, you, you you wanted a Sega Genesis? Oh, Genesis was a great system. I Super I mean, Nintendo was better, though. <clears throat> but, you know. I felt like Nintendo had way more games on the NES, like, at the time, or whatever. I don't think my... I think at the time I had a Sega Genesis, I don't remember my family having a Super Nintendo. They just had the NES, and mm -hmm. then I had the Sega Genesis in my room, and that was basically because uh, my brothers didn't want me to play their Nintendo, which kind of weird because it was like the family Nintendo, but I guess it was theirs. I don't understand. I like that catapult thing. That's kind of cool. So we yeah. load up our Pikmin on these rocks, or these flowers with the springs, and then boing. Yeah. But that, I mean, that's one thing I loved is like, you know, growing up, I was told like, oh, you're just in the way because you're not as good at games, so you can't play. And you're Harsh. Just, you're just kind of like annoying and, you know, you're just going to make me die, so please don't, you know, I don't want to play with you. And like Luke let me play even though I wasn't perfect at them and let me follow along and be Robin and I really liked it a lot. Luke is always encouraging to me playing games. I think what we need to do here is because I'm watching this back now like yeah. uh, I think I'm going to have to like do the full screen so because I mean you don't really see the characters as they're bouncing up and down do you? Oh um no not really. You don't always see them yeah. Yeah, and that's kind of an important aspect of the level design for this level, so... And there's so much going on on the top screen right now. Yeah. Like, I mean, maybe it would be a little bit overwhelming for some people right now, because there's just so much going on, like lots of sparkles and yeah. light effects and stuff like that. Yeah, but I mean, that's one thing that Luke really helped me with was, you know, like, people would say, Oh, you're not really a gamer because you're not good at this, and Luke would always tell me, Well, if you like playing games, then you're a gamer. Yep. It doesn't it's matter pretty, how good it, you are. It's, it's pretty simple, actually. See? This is what I was talking about. Look at all that. Yeah, this is pretty That's cool. beautiful. Oh, yeah, you get to see some weird creatures up there and stuff. I'm looking at a weird creature up there. Uh, yeah, well, I didn't really play with her that much today. I so. did! Oh, yeah, you took... And my leg got all hacked up. <laughs> I know. I think our, our kitty just has so much energy that... She's only a year old. Yeah. Like, we missed her birthday. We didn't really do anything special. July 8th, Zelda turned one years old. Oh! Oh, yay! And Shadow, we don't have her birthday, though, because she lived in a shelter, just like Tink, so... Yeah. Uh... I don't know. I'm just glad I didn't live in a shelter. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I missed! How can I miss that? Whoa! <gasps> oh, yeah, those... That's the weird creature I was talking yeah, about. Yeah, I don't like those. The weird Freaky little... Creepy looking. Mm, yeah, creepy things. Looks like Shadow is in a state of half awakeness, half sleepiness. Yeah. She's just hanging out. I wonder what she's thinking that. about. She's just having fun. Usually, I guess because Pikmin is like not a series where we're like screaming and jumping up and down that she's like, she's yeah, okay like, being here and watching, but well, usually she doesn't like it. Yeah, when we're playing Power Rangers, I'm like, Power Rangers doing she's like, like Power Ranger moves and whatever. Yeah. Like, come on! Let's do this! And then, yeah, Shadow is just not wanting to be around. But, yeah, when we play Pikmin, she's happy. So I was also half done with, uh... I know another thing I could do at night if I... Not as schedule streams, but something to consider. Is, um, remember I was mostly done with Bravely Second. Oh, but yeah. But we couldn't do that in our previous place because everybody was like, ah, oh, the internet got all messed oh, yeah, up. yeah, we and, were doing that at night. That was awesome. I, I tried enjoyed, to do it. I enjoyed doing that at night. But our new internet works so well. Thanks, Shadow. Yeah, thanks a lot, Shadow. Do you want me to get her off you? No, or? it's not going to make any difference. <laughs> I don't know if that makes any difference I either. I put a blanket over All right, top so of her. over up, she's like, all right, I'm gone. All okay. right, why don't, why don't you go for a walk? Walk it off. <laughs> <sighs> oh, my gosh, Shadow. Nope, blow it over in my direction. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, sorry. Gosh. It was like... There. All right, now we could have exited the level a few minutes ago, but the cat distracted me, yeah. let off the stink bomb, and also uh, there's some other things that we can do right now. There's a bunch of Pikmin up there, uh, two of them, and remember you do get bonuses for bringing back, you oh, know, more, more Pikmin, Pikmin, more yeah. workers. 
<laughs> More workers. More for the workers board. for the mines. Yes. The mines. Mine oh yourselves. Alright, stop, 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 stop. Ah. Hmm. So, what am I supposed to throw the bomb there? Or am I supposed to throw the bomb up higher? Hmm. Perplexing. And go. Nope, that didn't work. What about. Uh, maybe um, if we put the bomb on the flower? I always forget. Oh, yeah, so you were able to. Nope, that wasn't enough. <sighs> you know what? Um. This puzzle would take a while. Um, you would probably put a couple rock Pikmin, sacrifice a red Pikmin, and they would get blown up. No, and then you would dark. get... It, you would only caving. get two Pikmin from that, though, so I don't think that's really worth it. Yeah. Well, if we feel like exploring... Not really. No, Later. I don't feel all that like exploring. No. <laughs> not really. Maybe a smidgen, but no, not, not. Oh, not. that's right. I always wondered what he was thinking, and then I'm like, Ooh. oh yeah, that's right. He reads in his diary. Yeah. Captain Olimar. And actually, I heard that if you put different amiibo on here, amiibos, um, you can get different journal entries. So that's kind of cool. We might want to try that later. Yeah. Giant eyeball. Bye yeah, bye. Like, uh, I think the P. Clear from eyes. Donkey Kong. Clear eyes. <laughs> Well, I mean, you have some of the amiibos behind glass upstairs, so... Yeah. I mean, it's actually a good place for them. And you yeah. have all those amiibos that you have to do unboxing videos for. I was gonna for. do unboxing No, 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 no not was. I you am are doing them do before the end of the year. Videos, yeah. I thought I was just gonna get that one camera and set it up and do stuff, uh, but... Yeah, well... Uh, hmm. That didn't happen. Mm-mm. Okay, so we only got one item in this level, but eh, we got a bunch of happy Pikmin. A lot of happy Pikmin that are ready for the mines. Yay! Oh, that's terrible. You have such a horrible, evil grin on your face. Send them to the park. No! <laughs> Mr. K-Wing. Evil Mr. K-Wing. You're a mean one, Mr. <laughs> K-Wing. You really are a select an amiibo. <laughs> You can select an amiibo from the list of them below. I'm just going to come out and say it. I am very annoyed that in Miitopia, there are no Fire Emblem costumes. Fire oh Emblem is gosh. a series that technically is a first-party developed Nintendo game, and they're getting just as popular as Metroid and The Legend of Zelda. I know, right? And they are still shunned as, you know, Nintendo IPs. But technically... Pokemon should not be considered a first-party Nintendo IP because just like Fire Emblem, it's a second-party developer within Nintendo who made the game. Yeah, I know. Right. If they're within Nintendo, they just make for Nintendo, then why wouldn't they put them in the... I'm pretty sure that Pokemon costumes work. <sighs> That's frustrating. I don't know why... Ah! It's like Fire Emblem is, like, dissed or something. I love Fire Emblem, but I'm going to need another week, guys, to uh, grind some more so we can finish the game. You know what? I wish we could get a Shovel Knight costume, but I know they're not a first party. No. That would be awesome, though. I'd love a Shovel Knight costume. All right, this level is not cool. So we got this flaming ball of death. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Falling down all around us. Ah! Pikmin, stay in order. Don't get squashed by the falling death rock. <gasps> Oh, I'm so sorry! No! I didn't mean to do that! That was... That, oh, no! Uh, Alright, we're close enough. Watch out for that! We're far enough. Watch out for that flaming ball of death! Pikmin, Pikmin. Stay with me, guys. Of the jungle. Keep it going, keep it going. They don't want to die! Neither do I. We're fine here now, then. Okay. They're too small to die! Good job, guys. I'm proud of you. We're not dying. Whoa, that was kind of that was close. Okay, so as soon as this ball of death disappears, we're gonna run across the shovel. Run! Keep going, keep going. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. No! Oh man, we got killed by like a little no. thing while we were trying to avoid the uh, boulders yeah. from death. That mealy worm got you. Ah. Well, at least you have a couple red left. Yeah, well. Kind of. Uh-oh. 
That's right. We know how to switch characters like now, so we're fine. Something. Whatever it is, it's toast. It looked pretty before it has the eyeball on it. Oh, it. I thought that was like water reflecting. That's just a little shovel. All right, yeah. come on, jump up, jump, jump, jump. Oh, it's like a frog fly. Fly frog. Not anymore. Disturbing. Whoa. Disturbing! I don't like that thing with red eyes, Chris. It is kind of disturbing, isn't it? A little bit. Yeah. Well, I guess bit. we're on an alien planet. Yeah, there we're is that. A, an alien planet in uncharted space. Okay, so this is so you guys have a better view of what's going on. I want to see that fireball and go down. Go. Aww, Wait. yeah. Are we in space? There are sunflowers here. I don't... It's like a miniature version of Earth. Yeah. That's all I can think of at the moment. Earth 2! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I, I can rock it over here because I'm a rocket man. Yeah. I'm a rocket man. Can you believe he sang Rocket Man by being Shatner? Shatner voice Rocket Man. What? Yep. What are you talking about? In the 60s or the 70s. Oh, he just said it with his voice? He sang it, but he sang it like Shatner. There was no singing involved. It was speaking to the music. I'm a Rocket Man. Is that kind of like how... It's a thing. Is that kind of how Mark Hamill tried to sing at the end, but it was horrible? No, Mark Hamill really tried to sing notes. Yeah, that didn't work very well. Well, Troy Baker then sang, and I know. Troy Baker can sing, so... Yeah, he yeah. sounded way better. <laughs> but yeah, like, when people just speak it, it's just, like, so awkward. It's just, like, you're speaking to the music. I can That's speak of the music. Give me a contract. Rocket Man. To sell albums. Yeah, it's just horrible. I'll have to show you on YouTube. It's there. Oh, I just... Why would he do that? It's just terrible. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a butterfly! There you go. Now you can see better. Butterfly! Aww. No, they were gonna murder that thing in cold They're blood. They're so cute. Yeah, they were. You saw that look in their eyes. <laughs> they got, like, the Injustice 2 Superman red eye. Yeah, it, it's like, like yeah. in Galaxy Quest where those little... They're like, oh, that little one's hurt. They're helping him. And then it's like, rah! <laughs> they attack mm -hmm. him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Man, that was a freaky uh, part of that movie. Oh, my yeah, gosh. <laughs> Oh, whoa, no, whoa, whoa! Ah, oh, come no, on! I crushed you! Oh. That was not cool. No. That did not rock. What is that? Looks like a wallet. Oh, the kitty's <gasps> Oh my gosh! It's for Mario Brothers! It's Mario! Mario won! <laughs> Inevitable tragedy? Why what? do they call it that? It's not a tragedy, it was a great I, game. I have to read the bio of that. That's interesting. Maybe Olimar isn't good at Mario? <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool, you can send them up to get the little heart. You know, then. back in the 80s and 90s, adults couldn't play video games as well as kids and teenagers. Oh, yeah, because the ref you had to have good reflexes. Mm-hmm. Not anymore, though. Not really in gaming. Gaming has no, become a medium like everybody... that everybody can play. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I Which mean, I'm fine with, because I'm old. Er. Yeah. I mean, I feel like the older games, you had to have really good reflexes, like, of that of a child. Oh, I'm glad I already beat and showed that I can beat, like, Ninja Gaiden and all those other games, because I'm not going to be able to anymore. Yeah, I mean, like, and even today, when they make it games, gets games for kids... That... And I, they make, like, the games easier for little kids. In reality, the little kids could probably ga play games that are way harder mm -hmm. than the others. If you really think about it, because little kids have better reflexes, so... They should make the games for little kids even harder than adult games. <laughs> 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 That's how it was for us back in the day! When we had to walk ten miles to get a gallon With of... dinosaurs! Yeah, and yeah. we had to ride a Triceratops Rex. You know, technically that oh. dinosaur talk of ours is not really, you know, total bunk because there were tons of dinosaurs in the 1980s in pop culture and media, I television. Know, right? There were dinosaurs. There was. I so, remember. I mean, yeah. <laughs> oh, I know. Even uh, Transformers kind of started on prehistoric Earth, so... Yeah. I know, there's so much stuff about dinosaurs. 
I need to sh if we can find a way to get shows like Dino Riders, Dino Saucers, and stuff on DVD, I'd be pretty happy. Because there's still a lot of great 80s shows that were iconic that are still not able to be bought and watched again by people who are my age and also kids who love classic animation. Mm-hmm. Oh, we lost one. Ah, whatever. Oh my gosh, you're just as, uh, heartless as Olimar. Don't, don't sway back and forth too much because we don't want the uh, 3DS to get oh, disconnected. Oh yeah, aesthetic electricity, sorry. No, the capture wire is very loose. Uh oh. oh. Yeah, I can, I'll be careful. How did you die? What? All of his little They're friends They're all are... gone, yeah. And then, all my minions, I mean friends, were gone. No, no, okay. Oh, there they are. They hid, they were getting a rock. That's like kind of a checkpoint where the, the Pikmin are. Oh. Yeah. But sometimes cool. you can't get back to it, so. Oh, nice. Yeah. They hid under a rock. But Rocks oh, and red, leaves. Your red ones are gone. I don't need them. We're almost to the end of the level. You're on a shovel or a trowel. What is a thing called? Tr I don't know. Trowel. I've always called it a shovel. shovel. Run! Go, go, go. Come on, guys. Let's hustle. Let's hustle. Come on. Isn't it weird that there are fancy names for little tiny shovels? It's like, why? Why not call it a small <sighs> shovel? I don't know. Why make life more complicated than it already is? Kitty! <laughs> they weren't kidding when they said this level was Burning Sky, because that was crazy. Yep. Ridiculous. Hi. Sky begins to burn. Okay, <laughs> never mind. I don't know. Olimar, I thought you might like to know that there's been some activity at Pikmin Park. Captain Olimar! Fine. It's fine. I refuse to call him Captain, because that's my rank. <laughs> so he's simply Olimar. Yeah, there's Captain Kirk. It gives me my opportunity to speak French. <laughs> the Pikmin have found something. What have they found, Over Captain? there. I believe I have a headache coming on because of this voice penetrating my mind. Olimar, I'm happy to report that the Pikmin have found a stash of sparkling seeds. Exclamation point. This should yield very nice. That's 30 more sparkling. So you only need 30,000 sparkling to beat the game from what I've read. Oh, okay. uh, So I think we're going to be able to do it. I, I think... Or... Yeah. Technically you need 30,000, so, but, you know. Tap the location where you... Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I didn't know. I'll just send the Pikmin. Yeah, okay, I'm going to believe that this is, an, this is a, a scenario where Captain Kirk gets demoted and has to basically learn how to be a captain again because he fails miserably. So he has to go back to Captain Tutorial School again and... Captain Olimar teaches him how to be a captain again. Captain. He has to go through captain training again. Uh, so he becomes like a... Okay. I was going to say squire, but I don't know. Squire? I don't know what rank you are if you're not a I captain. I have no idea. <laughs> he becomes a secretary. All right, so... <laughs> he, he has to do Uhura's job, where he sits there and, like, basically... Well, actually, she kind of had a tough job looking at incoming missiles and stuff. Okay, he can be the janitor. I always thought Commander Sulu was the helmsman, though. Oh, yeah. Sulu, and then... You know, Chekhov actually did not... He did something important on I there. thought he was a helmsman, too. Yeah, I thought he was, too. Ah, whatever. All right, so... Uh, we we got some time left. Uh, let's play one more level. I can't remember that last movie they did. Nope, oh, yep. This is something important. Hang on, let me make this bigger. I'm picking up a huge load of sparkling underground, and it's moving... Oh no, you don't say. Squire I do Kirk. say. I, I <laughs> said. I don't know. Helmsman Kirk. Some indigenous creature must have holding on to it. You know what to do, Captain Olimar. Indigenous, yeah. Indigenous creature. Of yeah. course, Captain Olimar knows what to do. I just said it wrong he's on a, purpose. He's a cat. For dramatic effect. Ingenious species. I said indigenous. I know you did. Yeah. Later. Without an encyclopedia. Ah! 
Yeah, whatever. An egregious species. Want to know what people <laughs> love about our avatars is when we're playing systems that have nothing to do with the game that we're showcasing. <laughs> Yeah, I know. It's expensive to get new avatars, people. I, I know. What? I'm not going to be switching what I have in my hand. How do you know I'm not holding a Wii controller in my hand right now? He still has the originals. We could get 3DSs in our hands. Yeah, Even get different probably... color shirts. He could probably redo it with 3DSs. No, I mean, you can... I mean, I, I love the, That's supposed the to be style. for the t-shirt, though. Yeah, I know. I just use it for everything because it's so amazing. Okay, so this is a boss I don't want to be fighting. Oh, yeah, most people don't have controllers in their hands when they have their avatars. Oh, yeah, well. whatever. I love this picture because I love just weird t-shirts that have, like, cats on them and stuff. And you have you oh love Zelda, so it works out. Yeah, it did. How am I supposed to... Oh, my gosh. Take that! The belly of the beast. Oh, yeah, actually. Ooh, you can get his tail and. Come on. Run faster! Run with oh, your tiny no. little legs. Oh, he's on the ceiling. Watch out, he's probably gonna crush you. He's probably gonna jump down. Yeah. Yeah. No, this boss is no. pretty easy to read, though. He's not gonna. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Nope. He does that. And then he's gonna lift up. We attack. Attack! Charge! Oh, gosh. And we grab onto his tail. Come on, guys. Come on, men. There we go. I like this boss. Pikmin are so loyal. This boss is not that difficult at all. No. Bring it. Okay, Dana. maybe, maybe like. Oh no, he's difficult. Dial, now. dial it back a little. No. Okay, yeah, hit him on the tail end. Oh <gasps> nope. No, he's coming in. That's you. right. That's right. He leads us into the corner. And okay, that could have been painful, but that no. That could have been bad. That could have been bad, but it wasn't. So that's good. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Why Easy is he being there. So mean. He's like, doesn't even look. Like <laughs> yes, hurt him, hurt him lots. We're just gonna keep up with him. Throw the Pikmin on his tail. So rock Pikmin is what hurts this guy. I think if you had other Pikmin with you, it probably wouldn't be, you know, helping all that yeah. much. How convenient for him to have that little glowy pink thing. I know, right? Telling you where to hit him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, oh, come no! on. Don't eat me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, what are those things that he shoots? Those things are death. Oh, my gosh. What are oh you going to do? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Get him. R.I.P. 3DS. Oh, yeah. We got him. Boo. To the yeah, and look, we got a tiara. Ooh! Looks like princess tiara or something. Princess's tiara, not not princess. It's pretty. Although princess was probably prettier, because uh, he had yeah. lots of interesting things. Yeah, he liked different outfits. The yeah. subterranean tyrant completed. Sweet. So that means we get to go to a whole new sector. That was fun. Yep, pretty cool. And did all my pigments survive? I think so. Whoa. Okay, so we have 10,000 sparklium. We only need nice. 20,000 more sparklium. Ooh. I know. Ah, uh, Olimar, I thought you might like to know that there's been some activity at Pigment Park. That's you may want to go with bit that investigate. Ah. I appear to be attacked by the Klingons. You may want to call me Captain Olimar. <laughs> I don't know. I will not call an inferior being Captain. I oh refuse. <laughs> His nose is the size of St. Louis. The pigment have found something. <laughs> and your ego is the size of... Uh, never mind. My ego is the size of the moon. <laughs> Olimar, I'm happy to report that the pigment have found a stash of sparkling seeds. Yay. Probably only ten of them, though. I bet you want to bet. 10, 20. This should yield very nice 30. Oh, that's actually a nice haul. 30 sparkling. Nice. Sweet. Pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. Hi, kitty. Yeah. All right, so Shadow's we need to really about that. redirect the blue Pikmin to back to the pond because there's nobody working there. And I don't like that. I don't like that my Pikmin aren't doing their job. So we're going to grab you guys and put you right over there. There they go. 
And uh, yeah, we just kind of watched them uh, doing stuff. So our yellow Pikmin got all the electricity here. Um, I wonder if you actually go to a new park location after you uh, complete this area? Or what? Because, I mean, I don't know how many Pikmin parks there are. Oh, I know, right? Because whenever we go to a new sector, they're still here. This is kind of cool. Like, are they they're gathering resources all the time, even when you're not? Mm-hmm. Wow, they're really hard at work. Do they ever take a break, like Sundays off or anything? Or? No, they don't get. They don't even get holidays off. They don't. No. What about like? Uh, no. Do they get like a lunch break in the middle of the day, or they eat while they're walking? I don't have to ask these questions <laughs> unless uh, there's uh, some like legality to them or something. Yeah, I mean, aren't you afraid that? Uh... No. <laughs> All right. How many sparkling seeds do you think that is? I say five. Oh my gosh. Okay, ten. This should yield very nice ten sparklium. It's yeah. not very many. Aren't you afraid that the uh, the union is going to get on uh, Olimar's back and basically tell them he needs to give them more of a break? They're war working nonstop. None of these guys are resting at all. There's no union in this. The white Pikmin aren't here. <laughs> oh my gosh. We've got 10,000 sparkling now. Olimar, a, a third of the way there. That's Wait. great. Oh, he is wearing clothes, okay. I've set up for... <laughs> Never mind. I set up for you to view any indigenous creature you've encountered in the logs. Only by reviewing our past can we be prepared for our future. Yay. That's actually true in some respects. Yes. Like, Indeed. There are still more to fix, though 14,000 sparkly... Ah... I miss that. Uh, I'm getting <laughs> heavy sparkly readings from the next sector. She distracted me. It's her fault. You're fine, Kirk. It looks like a ruin was there once a mighty civilization of the world. Perhaps you'll find out. Uh, so we're like, what? Post-apocalyptic world where, I don't know, everything is smaller. So we're heading to sector four. Did you like how I say it? Sector Sector. 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 Sounds like a transformer. Anyway, guys and gals, thank you so much for taking the time to watch. Reminder that at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time today, we will be playing Miitopia live in Yay! front of all of you. Unless we beat the game already, which I don't know. We but uh, if you guys are enjoying the Pikmin series, be awesome and drop a like on the way out and tell your friends about the series. Until we meet again, God bless and have a gaming. See ya!